your brain is amazing and nobody else has one quite like it. Although everybody's brain looks the same, they all work differently from each other. Just as we all have different colour skin, hair and eyes, we all have a brain that's individual to us. Like a fingerprint, we have different personalities, tastes, strengths and weaknesses. Our brains can even see and understand the world in different ways. One of those ways is called dyslexia, which affects how the brain handles information it sees and hears. Dyslexic people may find it difficult to match letters to sounds and to remember how to spell words. They may even see letters moving around when they're reading. They might have trouble telling left from right. Remembering lots of instructions can be especially hard. They may need more thinking time to remember the right word. No, wait. Stop. As well as memorizing sequences. It may be difficult for them to hold a pencil and to write by hand. Even organizing themselves can be difficult. But everyone with dyslexia is different. It can affect how people feel about themselves. When they struggle with a task that other people find easy, they may feel frustrated, angry or sad. Some dyslexic people try to hide their difficulties because they are worried about what others will think of them. However, thinking differently can be a really good thing. A person with dyslexia may be very good at seeing patterns and solving problems, imagining and rotating objects in their heads, telling stories and making people laugh, taking things apart, understanding how they work and figuring out how to put them together again, inventing, drawing, painting, and making things, seeing the bigger picture. Dyslexic people can do a lot of things. There have been many famous dyslexic inventors, writers, scientists, business people, astronomers, paleontologists, actors, cooks, singers, artists, architects, and so on. Dyslexic people have changed the world. See dyslexia differently.